probably in September here in Rockhampton again. Certainly does. And uh, I'll tell you one thing. I don't think it's the, the women are just as much involved like the family. It's a family affair. Love seeing all the team shirts running around in the pits. It's just good all the way home. Now, you're the expert here, Kev, on super stocker action. Can we pick a winner out of this field? It's pretty wide open at the moment. Yeah, I can clearly see the winner. It's one of these cars out on the track at the moment. It's one of the 11 out there? Oh, that... yep, yep, that'll do, even the numbers. <laughs> Now, one of, one of the 11. The front two, these two have been banging and, and clanging all night. Brisky's had a little bit of time to regather the thoughts, so I think uh, he might be a very strong attention. But Pierce has really amped it up in his couple of last couple of heats, so uh, I'm sure he will feature heavily. There's no two ways about it. Here we go with the games. Let's get them underway. Jennings looking for a good jump. Leonard's going to go with him. Look, he's got a bit of speed there. He knows that that didn't work, but he stays in check. Kept it safe off the wall there at this time round, but it's allowed Pierce to come for a look on the inside. Here we see Brisky buried back there at the moment. He's got a bit of work to do. He'll challenge, he'll get this one done, but he's right in the infield pretty hard. Probably not the, uh, the best feeling for the machine. The Commodore working hard there to stay focused and straight. Lenning smoking the pipe there at the moment. He's got a bit of work to chase up and get back in position. Pierce at the moment doing what he does best there, right in the mix. So we've got a bit of an odds and evens going on, but it's a, a bit of a reshuffle. Look at Brisky. He's working hard with that car. It, it doesn't look as sharp as what it had previously in the night. Getting pinned, he's pinned back there behind young Harley Saunders, and he's just dropped another spot to Pierce. So Brisky not quite on song, with the front three cars are romping away with this one. Jennings, Pierce, and DJ Lennon putting on a cracking show out the front here. Well, they know they've got a couple of laps to get this one settled and start to work away at it. But if they have a three driver tear away out in front, makes it almost impossible for the rest of the field to play the game unless we get a, a restart or a stoppage. So at the moment, Jennings starting to get a little bit more intensity in the way of the 64 machine. So he's closing it, but Denning seems to be, Lenning, sorry, starts to be Drifting out of the back side. Oh, second place has a bit of a moment there. So Jenny gets another good look at the front. As we see the three exit stage left. That'll bring us to the yellow. So this will be reach out of the tree. Car's not in any danger, but the uh, the race will retighten the field and get another opportunity. So it'll be very interesting to see the Denning machine. And let's see what DJ Lennon can get amongst it with, with the 18 machine in third. He was letting Jennings get a little bit too far out. But Jennings is going to be about the control here. Watch him bunch him up here. He'll slow him down. And at the appropriate time, he will let loose and plant that right foot. And here it comes, ready and waiting. And away he goes with the green. That's what he needs, a couple of car lengths on it. Now, earlier, Lennon had a bit of an es uh, a lucky escape from the wall. He won't repeat the effort. So Pierce getting involved there. Let's get on with the job, he says. Front three are at it again. A little bit of contact from Lenning there. That might have uh, unsettled. Oh, the three looks for an ex early exit there. So the front two go to work again. Jennings looking tidy. The 46 machine has shown a very strong stature tonight. And he's remained untouchable at the moment. Uh, he is starting to attract some attention there at the moment. Lenning can't get close enough to him. The 64 there. He's trying to tap away and chip away at that lead. But again, he's going to fall back into that clutches of that 18. And that's not exactly what he wants. The 46 seems to be able to take a bit of breath at the moment. He knows he's got no one really best. Brisky going to work on Pierce of the 68. So they still in the hunt there, but he's going to run short of lats if he doesn't make a bit of a move here earlier. But he just doesn't seem to be comfortable with the car to push it harder than he is. So Jennings leads this one as Brisky and Pierce come together in the back straight away and get each other all unsettled. Jennings still leads. Back to Pierce. Look at DJ Lennon start to get some mumbo up as Tony Owens out of noise on the back straight away here. And the number eight Commodore and can't pull himself to the infield with the traffic coming past. We'll wait for a yellow as the laps wind down here with the number eight machine is ailing in turns three and four. Jennings, Pearson, DJ Lennon running one, two and three. 
Right, uh, Nibby happy, just about calling this. We see a little bit of pressure. I don't think this one with Britsky's got it where he wants it at the moment. He's surviving, but the top five is going to be frustrating him. Here he comes. Oh, he clips the back of Owens there. That's going to probably put him on the sideline too, I think. Owens going to know about it, bring us to a yellow. As Brisky can't roll out of that one, I don't think it's going to be very good. I don't think it's very good at all. Call the doctor. And Tony Owen, probably rightfully frustrated that he was rolling the top line, waiting for a yellow to be thrown. And ended up with a little bit of damage to the RK8 machine. So unfortunate that Brisky made contact with Tony Owen's machine. Bank at turn one. So at the moment, this is where we stand. We seem to get him back into order. Jennings starting to pick up the pace. And I know he'll roll the throttle off right about now just to bunch him up and get him nose to tail before he's ready to plunge that right foot into the throttle. Here he goes with a good jump. Again, Lennon wants to go with him strongly. The 64 there. Peter's around the corner, but it's on for the job. Jennings getting the business. End of things happening straight away. He wants to be out in front when the final check and lag runs its course. At the moment, he is doing everything in his power to make that happen. And he's looking like a shining light at the minute. The 64 in the game. Here comes Pierce for a move on Lenning on the backside of it. The 68 machine trying to apply the pressure one final time. He's got his hands full. Just got tag on the rear left corner there as well. So the three have bunched up at the back and that's the battle for third place. Here comes Pierce again. He drives him down the inside. He gets a little loose to the turn, but Jenning all in all is on his way home. And a hop skip and a run to the checkered flag is what he's looking for. It can't be too many more left to go. Oh, what have we got here? Second place. We've got a mechanical there. He's laboring in the back there. See how this one resettles the tree, landing over to second place. Jennings with a super buffer there. Oh, the battle for third still heating up. We've got gas cooking in the kitchen. Looks like we might have seen the last lap. Want to see a light on over there. Jennings turning up the heat, making sure it's a solid performance all the way. Could this be the check and flag? Last lap board out now. Jennings on his way home at the minute. The field has now settled down. The 46 machine looking to take this one all the way home and cross the line for the checkered flag. He's on the last and final turn. Then Lennon. And the five, there we go. Is that a stationary checkered flag, was it? Jennings, I'm not sure the flag was waved, but Jennings taking the victory there from Lennon. And that'll bring it to a close tonight. We didn't disappoint there. We started with a great handful of cars. And unfortunately, we whittled down. But we won one solid contender, the 46. Round of applause as he comes on through. See if he might grab the checkered flag and take the victory lap. And probably also a big round of applause for Andrew Platten to get that car back out there and finish in third position, Kev. That had a massive impact. A little right bit earlier in front on of the us. Night. You're right. You're right. Right in front of us. And he gets back on the podium to finish the night. What a.